We're asked to find the length of each side. Before I go through that, I'd like to uh, just show you an example that's maybe a little bit more straightforward. On this one, if they said that the perimeter is 19 inches, that means if you add up each, the length of each side, you're going to get 19. So that would be, we could write an equation for this, 3 plus 7 plus x is supposed to give us that 19. And now we solve for x. So you can combine like terms, 3 and 7, that gives us 10. Bring down your plus x. And now get rid of that 10. It's held there by addition or subtraction. So you achieve the opposite operation in addition or subtraction with the opposite sign. So I'll put negative 10 here, negative 10 here. Positive 10 with a negative 10 gives us a 0, so I don't have to write that. The x just drops down. And when we combine these two, we're left with a 9. Okay, So we figured out that x is 9 inches. So if that side's 3, that side's 7, this side is 9 inches. We'll use the same approach on the other problem. We'll add up these three sides, set it equal to 315, so that we're going to have a 2y, a 4y, a 3y, 315. So again, if we add up these three sides, that's going to be equal to 315. So this first step, we'll combine like terms. It's the same variable and exponent, so we just add the coefficients. 2 and 4 gives us 6, plus 3. That gives us 9y. All we did was combine the like terms, and we got 9y. We'll just bring down what we already had, which was equals 315. We want to get y by itself, so we need to get rid of the 9. It's held by multiplication, so the opposite operation is division. You always do the same thing on each side. Now you can clean this up. 9 goes into 9 once, so you have 1y, or we just write y, equals well, let's see, 315 divided by 9, um, maybe I'll solve that over here. So 9 goes into 31, uh, 3 times is 27, and then that's 4, bring down your 5. 9 goes into 45, 5 times. So we figured out that 9 goes into 315 35 times. That means y is equal to 35. But now they want the length of each side. Okay. So we take this y equals 35, and wherever the letter y shows up, we have to plug in the 35. So the 35 goes in there the 35 goes in there, and the 35 goes in there. And for each of these we're supposed to multiply. All right. So 4 times 35 is 140 feet. 3 times 35 is 105 
feet. Sorry, that's getting awfully small on you there. Maybe that helps out a little. And then 2 times 35 is 70 feet. And if you add up these three sides, you will get 315.